Ethiopia. Ethiopian and Somaliland military leaders meet in Addis Ababa. The military chiefs of landlocked Ethiopia and the self-proclaimed Republic of Somaliland met in Addis Ababa on Monday, January 8, 2024, to discuss military cooperation. The tete-a-tete -tete between Ethiopian National Defense Force Chief of Staff Field Marshal Birhanu Jula and Chief of Staff of Somaliland Armed Forces General Nu Ismail Tani comes on the heels of the signing of a Memorandum of Understanding on January 1st by Ethiopian Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed and Somaliland President Musa Bihi Abdi, which allows Ethiopia to lease a 20-kilometer strip along the Gulf of Aden for 50 years. The agreement gives Ethiopia a permanent naval base and commercial maritime services on the Red Sea. In return, Somaliland reportedly gets a stake in Ethiopian airlines in recognition of the, its independence, which Ethiopia has yet to confirm. While military discussions were being held in Addis Ababa, Somali President Hassan Sheikh Mohammed visited President Isaias Afwerki in the Eritrean capital Asmara to, quote, discuss issues of mutual benefit for both nations, including strengthening ties and fostering cooperation, unquote, according to AFP. The Somali central government, which does not recognize the independence of Somaliland, considers the agreement between Ethiopia and Somaliland an act of aggression. As mentioned by Anadolu Agency, the Ethiopian government maintains, however, that the deal, quote, will affect no party or country, unquote. Somaliland is a former British protectorate that seceded from Somalia in 1991, but is not recognized as a sovereign country by the international community. Ethiopian Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed raised eyebrows among his Horn of Africa neighbors before signing the agreement when he remarked that Ethiopia's existence is tied to the Red Sea. Shortly thereafter, he tempered his comment by promising that he had no plans to invade a neighboring country. Ethiopia lost access to the Red Sea in 1993 after Eritrea declared independence following the Eritrean War of Independence from 1961 to 1991.